Let me get started, okay? Okay. Hey everybody and welcome back to the channel. My name is Alton. With me I have my co-host Paxton. Say hi Paxton. Hi. How old are you Paxton? Um, six. You're four. Four. You're turning five. I'm turning five. Yeah. I'm, get, I'm getting old today. You're getting old today. Yeah. Paxton is homeschooling because we have a stay-at-home lockdown order. So mommy and daddy <clears throat> are his teachers today. Yeah. Yeah, you gonna help me unbox this today? Yeah. Me open right. it up. Normally I don't do straps, but I think this is gonna be really special. Okay. It's gonna be really special. Let me open it up for you. Well, I'll tell you what, I will do this part. Uh, okay. Yeah. I'm gonna do this part. I'm gonna take the tape off. I'm gonna pull this out like this. Oh, 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 oh. And then here, do you wanna pull that? Yeah. What's that? It's oh. uh Oh, those are those are buckles. Me open it up. Well, hey, it's, no, 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 no. It's in there. <laughs> There's keys. This is not easy, folks. Oh, I'm, I'm excited. Four-year-old who's been at home. So it's like an advertisement for watch. Let me keep not. this, Dad. Okay, let's put this here. Do you know what want, this is? Yeah. These are extra buckles that Reef put on here for me, and this one's really cool. This is his own custom buckle. Love This is a strap from Wristwatch Me, which yeah. is a Canadian company bespoke straps and I really wanted a strap for this bad boy right here this is a Long Island watch Islander that is super dusty Look, he came really really cool watch Look, he came I did a review of these I'll put a link up for it um, didn't come with great straps didn't come with a great strap no offense to Mark or anything. I think he didn't focus on the strap when he was putting his budget together. And I'm okay with that because I'm a strap junkie, as you know. Love my straps. So I wanted something special and I couldn't quite find it. So I reached out to Reef at Wrist Watch Me and said, Hey, can you make me a strap? And he said, Absolutely. Open it up. So I don't usually unbox straps. I don't even have any of my setup here. But what? I really wanted to show this off because I'm really excited about it. Da, 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 da. Ooh, a little note. What's that? Is that a note? Can you read that? Yeah. Yeah. It says, Spring bar tool. Stay, it say you like these straps. You like these straps. You do. You want them. You don't. You don't like them. Is that what it says? Yeah. Okay. Here's the bottom. And I am wondering what's going on here. Can't find the top. Ah, there it is. Da, da, da. I was nervous for a second. Let's put this back. This is cool. Check it out. Claw. Okay, I did it. Okay. I took your spring tool out. Another spring tool. So, this is Italian calf leather. I wanted something with an aggressive pattern to it. I wanted something that was rugged, something that was going to wear in. Because I wanted it to go with this pilot strap. Check that out, though. How great is that? It's got this orange seconds hand. I wanted the orange stitching. Oh yeah, that's fantastic. So the process for this was really interesting. We talked a lot on Messenger through Instagram about what I wanted. We talked about dimensions. I gave him all my wrist size dimensions. Uh, that He sent me pictures of different kinds of leather. And uh, I was able to pick the leather that I wanted. Oh, I really like that color in the backing. And, uh, and at the end of the day, I just said, hey, just go ahead and, uh, and do something. Just put it together, send it to me, surprise me. You know what I want, what I'm looking for, generally. And there you go. I'm just, i got to show you what, what Paxton's doing. He's, uh, yeah, he's doing that. So we're going to put this on the watch, and then we will get back to you. You may have noticed that I haven't been uploading videos as much lately. And the reason for that is Ontario is in lockdown. And unfortunately that means my kids are home with me and I'm teaching and working from home alongside my wife. And as great as Paxton is and as fun as he is at helping me at unboxing content, he is just maybe not the best at sitting quietly and, and really analyzing something. So I'm in the office right now. It's been a few weeks. And I thought I wanted to go over this strap because it is just a great strap and it's worth looking at in a little more detail. I do apologize for the sounds of construction outside my window. Again, this is COVID. We're working under less than ideal conditions. But let's check this out, okay? So 
First of all, let's just talk about this packaging. Um, maybe it's a little overkill for a watch strap, but it's really impressive. I have to say that between the, the hang tags and three buckles included. Now, I don't know if this is always the way, but this is his custom buckle, which I will try out. And there's a brushed buckle. And then he included this, this black buckle as well, which is very, very nice. Unsigned, but that's that's okay. I don't know why we have to sign everything. And spring bar tool, of course. So pretty awesome. And then, of course, a nice little note. And I like that slogan, two hands, one passion. That's pretty cool. So let's set that to the side. That's the, uh, the packaging for now. Let's take a look at the strap. This is the watch for which he made this strap. And so I sent him pictures. He knew all about it. And the watch itself cost about twice as much as the strap. But that's okay. I really like this watch. And it was a gift. And I'm really, really happy to invest in it. I've worn this for a number of weeks. And you can see that it's worn in very well. I particularly like the detail there where he did a double stitch on the sides in that upper box just adds a little bit of a interesting like I would have thought to do that and he did that and I think it's really cool the color is spot on it's a little more orange in real life than I see on the camera I might be able to adjust that in post same with that seconds hand there but it just really suits it well the edge paint has done well as you can see the keeper is solid taper is just as I asked. The length is perfect. You'll notice there's a little detail on the keepers. He rolled a line around each keeper. It's just, it's those little details that that really set this apart, that, that really let you know that this is a custom bespoke piece. I particularly like this lining. In fact, this lining is so nice that it could be a strap itself, I think. Everything is clean, everything is smooth. Like, look how that's glued down. So well done. The one issue I am having is it's so thick here at the lugs that you see how it's it's folded down. And the reason for that is I, uh, I scratch the leather if I move it up and down. So I've just set it where I need it and I leave it and, and that's okay. Had I known that the lug to lug was the lug distance from the pin to the case was so small, I would have asked perhaps for either a rounded contoured version, if he makes those, I don't know, or at least some curved spring bars to alleviate that issue with not having enough of a gap. But you know what? This is working for me. It's no fault of Reefs. He had no idea that it was so small, and neither did I, or I would have mentioned it. So there you go. A beautifully made strap. I really love everything about it. I know it's going to hold up for a long time. And the price, it was just over 100 bucks Canadian shipped to me. When you think about the time that he spent dialoguing with me on how I wanted it made, the time he went into planning it, and then actually crafting it. This is a, a one-off piece. He's not doing 10 of them in a row and, and, and pumping these things out. This is a one-of-a-kind piece. For that kind of money, it's just a no-brainer. If you're in Canada, I would say definitely check Reef out. He is a great guy to talk to. You can find him on Instagram. Here's his info as well. And again, this is not a paid endorsement in any way, but I'm just a happy customer. I love straps. I know that you folks love straps. And if I can pass on some great information on a good strap supplier and maker, then I'm gonna do that for you. Well, thanks so much for watching everybody. If you feel like liking and subscribing, go right ahead and do that. But I can't tell you what to do. I'm not your dad.